After Hugh Hammer, the blacksmith, joined the blacks, he was knighted, then given a land on Driftmark by Queen Rhaenyra. He and Ulf the White fought fearlessly with the blacks in the battle in the gullet. However, he betrayed the blacks. Both he and Ulf the White were sent to defend the town of Tumbleton from Ormond Hightower's host, but they defected to the Greens after promises were made to them. Hugh later became delusional and thought he could be king. He had heard of a prophecy about a new king arising once a hammer falls on a dragon, and this got into his head. Some of the soldiers actually believed this prophecy and he gained their support. He became impertinent and even got a crown of black iron. When Sir Roger Corn knocked off the crown, he nailed three horseshoes into Sir Roger's skull. This angered Sir Roger's supporters who wanted to avenge his death. A fight ensued between the two supporting groups leading to three deaths and a number of them being wounded. Hugh was killed by Sir John Roxton with his Valyrian steel blade while preparing for the Second Battle of Tumbleton.